Okay, hi guys, it's Desiree. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be reacting to season 4, episode 9. This finger is up. Episode 9. Of 30 Reasons Why, and the title of this episode is Prom. Now we are on the second to last episode. That means the next episode is the series finale. And I am so excited. Um, last episode, we saw the school protesting, I mean, the students protesting against the school for all the, the, um, school, like, security measures that they've been doing. Like, they've literally, like, here's the line, and this is where Liberty High School is. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to do much talking. I'm just going to get right into the reaction. But if you want to see my reaction to episode 8, I will put it up in the eye. And I will link the playlist to the 13 Reasons Why, my 13 Reasons Why reactions in the description. With that being said, let's get right into the video. Excited. The cover picture is Jessica and Justin, and they actually look really cute. I know I've been going back and forth with them this season, but I'm kind of here for it. So, Charlie, please wake up. Oh, don't tell me Charlie's Charlie, in a coma. Come on, please. His dad's gonna walk in or something. Are you okay? Yeah, the flu or some shit. Mm mm. He's coming down from that high. He's not stupid. You told me you would stop. I did. I mean, this. It's just what it must be. Look, I just need some sleep. What were Diego and Justin fighting about? A student mentioned hearing them talk about a tape. My involvement was instigated by an oppressive police state trampling on students' rights. Really? Yeah. Hey, the Marines, I did a tour on the Korean DMZ. I'll tell you about a police state sometime. And then things got worse. Oh, okay, so your first. response to all of this is just... You're playing this so cool when it can go really bad for you. What exactly do you think you're threatening me with? I think you know. <laughs> That's funny. I gotta tell Justin. Don't you fucking laugh at me. Diego. 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 I felt bad for you last episode. I showed you some sympathy last episode because it happens all too much to our people. But I will let it be known right now. This is not going to happen. This is not going to go down. You are not going to get mad at her. You are not going to point a finger her and you, at her and you are not going to touch her. That, I'm going to let that be known right now. There's a reason why writers, I'm going to let that be known right now. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. I'm on my way to Foundry. Maybe I'll talk. Oh, so I thought he was going to hand her a ticket to prom. They talked to Diego today. You have Diego handled, right? Here's the thing. Diego's on to us. So is Estella. So is Winston. Foundry heard the tape and I was interrogating the whole school, starting with Diego, and who knows what he said. They're only doing this... Because of the parents. My dad told me all the boosters have been calling him. They asked for an investigation, and the school caved. So we are dead. What if we got our parents back on our side? But they oh, have they, have to, they have to. They have to. How do we get them to trust us now? They have to Don't feed them trust. a little. Very, like, breadcrumbs. <laughs> yeah, and we're losing. If we get them back on our side, we might have a chance. We asked them to help us stop an investigation? Not directly. First, we get them on our side by confiding in them. And then, we ask them to help us get back prom. It's like a bait and switch. Ease off the police state so we can get back prom. 
see charlie you are so smart and she says you they're gonna believe that we care about prom question mark yes first of all prom is the thing that every senior looks forward to and so knowing that your school is canceling and they know that you're already devastated so if you just feed them a little bit of breadcrumbs and get their trust back tell them that you want to try to get prom back on they're gonna go hard okay parents will go hard for their children god i hope if i ever have kids i'll be able to to know anyways we didn't know you'd start singing your songs alex standall is obsessed with this song the wreck of edward fitzgerald edmund fitzgerald uh, but the, the, point. <laughs> the dad is taking it to the heart, bro. He's taking it to the heart. <laughs> Here, That's a good compromise. At this point, it seems that you know more of our secrets than we do of yours. Oh. Here we go. What are we telling them? Vandalism in school. The broken windows. Not the windows. One's car. I did all those. We want to go to prom. Oh yeah, that's definitely going to get his parents, their parents, to cooperate. When have they ever said that they wanted to go to anything like that? So, I'm not 100% straight. I'm not any percent straight. Yeah, it's the fact that you thought he was. Bisexual, I guess. Oh, I take that back. I bet he's gonna be like, I know. I knew. I always do. Watch. Yeah. What do you mean, yeah? Parents just know. know. Parents know. I'll take full responsibility for the riot. You suspend me as long as you need to, but you don't expel me. The police charge me with instigating a riot, and they drop all charges on anyone else, especially Justin and Diego. You know they'll destroy your college. Yeah, I was just gonna say that. Maybe. And you know but she doesn't care because she didn't get into her top three schools. Is that what she's going to say? Their community college is always there. And... Yeah. Oh. Girl, can I just say, now that I know that that's Haley Hotchner, I can't see her the same. Because I literally, I, I kid you not, I was literally just watching Criminal Minds. Like, I just saw her with the jet black bob. And now seeing her with blonde, long hair again, it just feels, it, older, it just feels unnatural. Like, I need to, like, really just, like, pause it on her face and just stare at it for a little bit. No, no, no we're not doing the whole pathetic friends. Okay, can I just say, I don't get what's the whole big to-do with going to prom with your friend. Like, I went with my friend. Hello. If I could find our prom picture, I'm putting it up right here. We went to prom together. We killed it. Period. There's nothing wrong with going with your friends at all. You don't need a man to take you to prom, okay? Jessica Davis. And, dude, all the men in high school are trash, so you especially don't need a man to take you to prom. You and I have fought like lovers. Now, I've talked sex with you more than I have with any man. I believe I had a crush on you since the first time I saw you going mental at a student council meeting. <laughs> so with you... Not as friends, not as girlfriends, but as you and, and me. me. Oh. Will you go to prom with me? Dude. I love this friendship. She's so beautiful. <laughs> Tina Baker, right? Yeah. That's Nimue. <laughs> That's Nimue on season one of Curse. Oh my god, I totally forgot about that picture. That was so beautiful. I do, I will say I actually do miss Katherine Linkford on here, but I understand why she had to take some time before going back into another show. I love her. I like how they're paying homage she to her. Beautiful. Would you, um... Are they going to go to prom? Would you ever want to go to prom with me? As friends. Um, as 
Like, like senior prank? Yeah. Oh, that's very creepy. Well, that's just creepy. I just said that. I just said that. <laughs> this is when you go to prom. Go to prom. Oh. <laughs> Wait, okay. you want to say yes, bro? <laughs> right? Yeah, yes, yes. I'll be home in like five. If I say yes, will this all stop? Yeah. <laughs> Alex, I need you to, I need you to walk with me. He's made three separate, different asks for you, and you haven't said one yes to not one, okay? Do you know how lucky you are? Some of us couldn't even get one. Hold <laughs> on. <laughs> no, it's just third wheeling. A, so what if it were? Would you love me any less? And B, it's actually sort of the opposite of gay because Alex asked me to tag along because I think he's afraid Charlie's going to make a move. Mm, yeah, he is super known for his hands. So. Yeah, I just think you all three look adorable. And I never say that about Clay. That is true. You don't. Mm. You guys look great. You should be prom queens. Uh, not a chance. They always vote for whoever the football team wants, and that is definitely not me. Well, the monarchy is an outdated establishment. Look at them! Besides, I think we have some competition for the hottest couple right here. I only came because you made me. Hey, thanks for your help with uh, all that after, you know, everything at school. Hey, no help from me. Sheriff D is really looking out for your kids. Okay, I need to know what's the deal with. Sheriff Diaz Cuz I was I was thinking that he was gonna be on to them this entire season and he really hasn't he's actually been very like in the background well I Don't know he's been kind of like in the background. I Mean clay did sleep with his daughter But dude tonight is not the night to be thinking about that come on Justin Why is it every time that I'm filming, there's people blowing fireworks or it sounds like gunshots? I do not understand. I mean, everything's burning so brightly tonight, and I just, I'm, like, I'm trying to take it all in. I'm trying to burn it all into my memory. Oh my god, I just thought back. I just thought back to when they were at the dance. And him and Hannah's song came on. And then they all came. Like everybody in the group came and just hugged him in a group hug and they danced. Please don't do that to us tonight, but I'm just, it's a good moment to re reminisce on. Like, that was a really good, wholesome moment from the group when they all just, like, came together and just, like, you know? I'm a high school senior, you know? Like, I, and there have been moments these past few years when I, I forgot about high school altogether, and I, I just, I mean, it's been a crazy ride. <laughs> Tony does not care. And, and horrible. But also... Amazing. Can Justin show up and dance with him and they could be lived brothers? I a lot. I have enough to prove it. Why do you? I'm sorry. And you can. I understand he wants to get justice for Monty, but why are you bringing this back up? Like you're literally opening up wounds that were closed. I don't know. I feel like he needs to just. I don't know. I don't want to say, like, let it go, but I also want to say, like, he needs to just let it go because Monty isn't, isn't the cleanest in the game either, as we know. It's all messed up. It's all messed up, and they all just need to enjoy their prom, graduate, and then just leave each other alone. Oh, Monty. Oh. Oh, my God, and it's The Good Side by Troy Sivan. Stop. This song makes me so, like... Is this gonna be him dancing with his ghost? Oh my god, that's gonna look so weird because it's just him by himself. It doesn't matter. It's, it doesn't matter. I got the good side of things. Let 
left you is for the Oh my god. Stop, I'm gonna cry. This is so like Like, I know what Monty did was terrible, and I know he's trying to bring justice to Monty's name. But this is, like, I don't know. I honestly don't even know my feelings on the whole situation anymore, because they're just everywhere. But this right here, what we're about to watch, is absolutely beautiful. They get to share one last dance together and not have to hide their feelings. Even though he is his ghost, that's still very beautiful. I loved him. He didn't even know me. And I never would have let you love me. I didn't let anyone. But I didn't even get a chance to try. Stop. I miss you. You are making me You miss your idea of me. Do not tell me Zach was about to rape that girl. What in his what in his in his right mind would make him want to do Oh god, just just just, just let this play out. Fine. She's fine. Okay. We need to get her coffee and a lift. Jesus, Zach, you're a mess. Aw, oh, Prismilla. Pr pr Be better. Pray. Yeah, tell him, Charlie. You tell him. School him. What is wrong with him? Wow, he really looks sleep deprived. Holy shit. Jessica Davis, me. Still in fucking high school. Yeah, I hear that. We're fucking dancing. All right then. Okay, gay love. No, 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 no. We're dancing too. Come. On. I'm gonna miss seeing Tony and Caleb. Like, give them a show. Give them a spinoff. I'll watch it. Where is I? I'm um, just. Everybody moves out the way. Anyway. Wow, Diego's really hurt. Wow, he actually, he really likes her. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, th this is like, this is kind of like also sentimental to like the actors. Because if you think about it, they've done like high school dances. They've done at least one high school dance, possibly two high school dances in the last three seasons. So, like, this is their, you know, final high school dance that they get to film. Like, all together, you know what I'm saying? Like, all together. So, I guess this is kind of sentimental also to the cast. Like, this is their last dance. Okay. Oh, my is it? Stop. Is he going to dance with his mom? Okay, honestly, I don't even care what I said before. I would totally dance with my mom. I would have thought you'd be here with her tonight. Hey, mom. Stop. Stop. Would you like to dance? Would you like to dance? Stop. I would love to, <laughs> love to dance. <gasps> no. No. What happened? What happened? What happened? And it was. 
was. No. 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 No, I don't I don't accept that. Okay. I'm gonna make this quick because now I, I for sure have to see the last episode because I need to know what's happening to my Justin. Okay. Hold on, let me close this for two seconds because I'm not gonna even think. All I've been saying this season is I want Justin to be happy. Now we are getting very, very close to the end. And when I mean very, very close to the end, I mean we have one more episode. And we still don't know whose funeral we were at at the beginning of the season. Now, all I'm saying is it better not be, it better not be Justin. Just thinking about his face is making me sad now. Justin, he's done a lot of fucked up shit, okay? He has. But I think Justin has shown some of the most character growth in the last four seasons than pff, a lot of people, than a lot of people, okay? He went out, he started from being someone that we hated to someone that I will protect with my whole being along with Tyler and the rest of the group. Hold on. Okay. I'm going to give this episode a 9. I think I gave the last episode a 9. Because it was very cute and wholesome. And it, it brought back the prom, the feeling of prom. And like that one last like hurrah with your senior class before graduation. Because graduation you don't really like... I don't know how to say it. You don't really hang out with your senior class like that i mean like you hang out with each other for like your breakfast and and then you walk across the stage get your diplomas you get up and you leave and you never see each other again and yeah i brought back a lot of a lot of feels um yeah i'm gonna go because i really really want to watch the finale i'm so worried about my justin I, do, oh my god, every single time I say his name, I just see his little face. And my eyes are watering. So I'm gonna go. My, okay, I'm gonna go, and I'll see you guys in the next reaction. Bye! Mm -hmm.